What's up, Falcons Nation? It's your boy, Ju, coming at you with another Atlanta Falcons video. As always, Falcons Nation, rise up. In today's video, I would like to talk about Muhammad Sanu, but if you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell so you know when I've done Atlanta Falcons content. Hit that like button for your boy. I do appreciate each and every one of you guys for your continued support, continuing to share out my content on all the social media platforms. If you'd like to follow your boy on Twitter and Instagram, you can follow me at Jutalk Sports. If you'd like to donate to my channel, you can donate to my cash app, which is the dollar sign Jutalk Sports. And if you'd like to be a part of my Jutalk Sports membership, you can hit that join tab here on the channel as well. But with that being said, let's jump right into the video. So in today's video, um, as I mentioned, I do want to talk about uh, Muhammad Sanu and why the Atlanta Falcons should consider Muhammad Sanu for the wide receiver uh, coaching position. Uh, Muhammad Sanu is a former Atlanta Falcon. Uh, he did play on that 2016 Super Bowl team. Um, and Raheem Morris, who is now our head coach, uh, was the wide receiver coach uh, during that season. And during a couple of the seasons that Muhammad Sanu was here with our Atlanta Falcons, uh, Muhammad Sanu does have a great relationship with Raheem Morris. Um, and I definitely think that Raheem Morris should consider Muhammad Sanu for that uh, wide receiver coach position. Uh, Muhammad Sanu has stated numerous times that he would like to come back and work for the Atlanta Falcons organization. He was one of those guys that was a fan favorite when he was here in Atlanta. A really good uh, route runner. He's about 6'2", 6'3", so he was a bigger wide receiver. Um, one of those guys that was really good in the Wildcat, could throw the football, um, was a great blocker uh, in the running game, and was a great compliment to Julio Jones as a number two wide receiver. So I definitely think bringing in a guy like Muhammad Sanu could help guys like Drake London, Kyle Pitts. He could help these younger guys learn how to run routes, learn how to read defenses, learn how to read zone and man coverages and things of that nature. He was also a really good wide receiver at moving the chains on third down. He was a guy that could play in the slot and play on the outside, similar to uh, Drake London. So I definitely think the Falcons should consider Muhammad Sanu for this position. Similar to Raheem Morris, uh, Muhammad Sanu is one of those guys that um, is a very humble a uh, guy, a guy that has mentioned numerous times that he loved when he was played for the Falcons and that he would love to come back to the organization. So I definitely think that the Falcons should consider him being that he has um, a relationship with Raheem Morris, being that he was a, a really good player when he was in the league. Uh, one of those guys that everybody raves about, similar to Raheem Morris, all of his teammates basically talk about Muhammad Sanu being one of those guys uh, that was a really good teammate, a guy that was a really good locker room guy. Um, and, and I considered him a glue guy for that Atlanta Falcons team in 2016, 2017, and 2018. He was one of those guys that took Calvin Ridley under his wing, even after he seen Calvin Ridley was going to overtake him for that number two wide receiver position. He was one of those guys, him and Julio Jones, uh, kind of helped uh, Calvin Ridley as a rookie. And in this going into his second season before Muhammad Sanu was traded, he took Calvin Ridley under his wing and kind of you know, work with him on routes and things of that nature and helped him uh, adjust uh, to the NFL. So I definitely think that Muhammad Sanu is one of those guys the Falcons should consider for that wide receiver uh, head coach or wide receiver coaching position. Um, being that uh, Raheem Morris was in those uh, rooms with him doing film study and things of that nature, I'm pretty, sh I'm pretty sure he would know if Muhammad Sanu is a guy that would be a good coach. And personally, just from uh, my encounters with Muhammad Sanu, uh, just from the things that I've seen when he was here with our Atlanta Falcons, I have heard nothing but great things about him, not only as a player, but as a person off the field. Um, and I definitely think it would bode well if the Falcons would consider him for that wide receiver uh, coaching position. Um, but with that being said, this being your boy, Ju. You guys give me your thoughts on Muhammad Sanu. Do you think the Falcons should consider Muhammad Sanu for that wide receiver coach position? Personally, I think he would be a great asset to the Atlanta Falcons team, um, not only because he, like I said, he was a really good player, but he was also a guy that was really good, um, you know, at helping the younger guys when he was here with the Atlanta Falcons as a veteran player. And I really think he could come in and help some of these younger guys that we have on this roster. But with that being said, this be your boy, Ju. I have a lot more content coming for you guys, but as always, Falcons Nation, rise up, be blessed, peace.